Hello, I'm fixing everything. And because there is always something to be fixed, today I'll show you on a Vectra C how to replace the parking light. This one, right there, on the side of the air filter. It doesn't work in showing parking light fault. So we need to remove the air filter housing. I don't know what I'm doing really because I never replaced it, but just follow me along. Watch the whole video just in case I miss to tell you something. And everything is going to be fine. So pull the holes out. And then we need to uh, take this box out as well. Like so, can I get to here by removing this one? No. Okay, so so after we remove this hose, we need Torx T25, if I remember right, here, yeah, to remove the screws. Um, I'll use this one like so. This one I think is pull, yeah, pull this way and just try it out. Do you have other screws now? Just make sure they're fully on them. Ah, there is one more. There is one more and for the other one I'll just get back to the seven. Is it seven? So when you're removing it, I don't remove it from here, remove it from here. We'll figure it out now. Twist. Counter counter clockwise. And as the plug I can see it right there. I think it's uh, just a normal clip, yeah. Okay. Now type of bulb is we're just gonna pull it out. That's the type of bulb we need, which is W5W. 12 volts, 5 watts. Let's see now. One bulb. You can put it in and pull it out a few times just to make sure you have a nice connection. All the way in nicely. And now just a simple push, yep. So I just pushed it in. There we go. Now, don't forget 
this pipe here when you're putting the air filter box and there is a connection over there and here and this pipe so it's a bit awkward to put it back in definitely it's a bit awkward but I don't think you can change it without uh, without taking the air box out so I'll just put the rubber right here okay, and then the piece of can you see it? If you can't see it, they can't see it as well, so just film it nicely. Now we push in here. So there is a, a little thing it needs to go in right there. I don't know, no? So everything is in place. These two pipes go like so. Okay, let's check. This pipe is okay. The drainage on the bottom here looks okay as well. And now the air filter, you can replace it. I think this one is still relatively fine. It's not the best, but it will do a few more thousand miles. And now the box clips right here here and over there it's like hinges there we go oh wait, no let's put the bolts on or should we check the light if the light is okay yep, the bolts working Let's just finish the job. It doesn't want to get tight, but there is a few other bits that we're going. So this one is here with the plastic lines and that's it. That's how to replace the parking light on uh, Vectra C. Removing the air box. Otherwise, I don't think it's possible. I really hope the video has been helpful to you. Leave me a comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.